testing audio with the bad voice. Ha ha, this is going to be a fun one. Well, hello there guys, how's it going? Welcome back to another episode of My Sick Voice. Yeah, I don't know if you can tell, I've been rather ill for a, like a couple of days, quite a few days. Yeah, I was off work a couple of days, and was it like Thursday, Friday, went back today, and I still feel like... <clears throat> so... I'm going to continue this video with a sweet in my mouth, because that's going to help with my, um, help my voice. This is going to be awkward with a sweet in my mouth as it is, but I'm hoping it's going to help with the voice. What this video is actually about, well, what usually happens when I'm like this, I haven't really been doing any gaming videos because of reasons, but I at least do these things when they come in. So it's a geek fuel box. So let's get straight into it. Feels quite light this time as well. But there should be better material shirts, apparently. So we'll see. Uh, I need to do this a bit more in camera, don't I? So let's do that. And we go dun 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 I don't know why I do it like that, because there's always the key, the the thing on the top, so you can't actually see anything. Magazine, I should say. Yes. And it has Zelda inside. And this looks like an interesting shirt. They do feel quite nice. It does feel quite nice. What is it? Is that from Fallout by any chance, maybe? Yes. That confirms it's from Fallout. So that's pretty cool. And it does feel a little bit nicer kind of material than normal. Okay, well, this one's thinner and yeah. Um, can't really put this on because I've got a shirt. Shirt shirt instead of the thing, so I can't really put this on right now. Otherwise it'll look weird. So it's just going to have to go over here for a moment. And I hope you can still hear me with my voice failing still. Right, what have we got? we got a game. Which is a little bit beat up. Uh, this is Archie and Crazy Professor. So Archie Bold's Adventure. I'm sure I've heard of that before. Oh. So Archie and the and Crazy Professor Clumpfus are stuck in the professor's mansion after the latest experiment of the goofy scientist went all wrong and weird. And, oh, and weird life forms escaped from their containment. Now a paranoid central computer locked both heroes up. Sounds a bit like Resident Evil. Help Archie to overcome all of the pitfalls of a mad scientist's mansion in their action puzzle game. Test your skills and wit in more than 190 levels. Wow, that's a lot. I don't know if you can really see that as well. So that's that. We got a little pin badge. If I can get it out first, I can't, so <coughs> we'll change. We have Property of Bruce. It's a it's a um poster. There's the word. More posters to go in my little poster thing. And I have a certificate of authenticity. Am I holding this right away? I am. Oh, it's a Batman thing, I'm guessing. Because it's a property of Bruce, right? But it's a Batman thing. Because that's Batman. And a weird cartoony kind of thing. And it says Arkham on it. <coughs> and a wham. And a pow. And it's got a penguin and a clown and a... Yeah, it's it's a Batman thing. So another poster go off my wall at some point, whenever I get a wall to put it on. So what have we got here? Sword. Of some sort. Give your security the power of the sword portable charger. This seems interesting. And of course it's got sticky bits on it. Scissors. Come on. I've done it. Haven't I? Yes. Why aren't you coming out? Thank you. Okay. Ooh. Okay. 
So it's a big chunky sword type thing from... Uh, it's dangerous to go... It's dangerous to go alone. Take this. Uh, I'm guessing this is Zelda still. I'm guessing it's because uh, you can see there's two things there. You plug it in... You plug in like a USB... In the USB port and that bit into that. It's the bottom one. To charge this up. And then you can reverse it and put it into a phone to charge your phone up later. Which is bloody awesome. Yes, bloody awesome. <clears throat> right, okay, now we've got the pin. Ooh, hello. What's this? Come to that in a moment. Uh, Stranger Edition. So we got real world and upside down world. An ultra rare of upside down will, which I don't have. Limited edition, collectible pin, stranger edition. At least I don't think that's the upside down one. No, I think it's the normal one. Yeah. So I've got the normal one, which is this side. And then there's this thing. And then there's an ultra rare one, which only one person can have. Apparently, start your own collection on the sturdy metal game. Yeah, so that's another awesome pin that needs to go on a pin thing when I get a pin thing. And I also have this thing, which is Nico World Amusements. Nico World, enter your ticket number. Prize ticket. I have a prize ticket and I need to go on to the a website and enter my ticket number. Interesting. I will do that shortly. So then we've got New World Amusements. Uh, it all seemed a lot more amusing before you actually showed up. Now the games are deadly and the crews are lawless, leading gangs and taking over sections of the park in your quest to beat the Commonwealth is the only thing you'll be doing but man those souvenirs. From that. Uh, that's the box empty by the way, box is empty. Yep, this box is going down on the floor. Then we got 8 bit sword portable charger. When you're stranded without power it can feel hopeless but what if you need to catch a lift? Saving today is the sword like portable power source. So yeah yeah it's portable power source which is awesome. Um, doesn't show. So in the real world all you know is that sometimes you can get turned upside down and never find your way out. Will you stay above ground or get stuck down with a limited edition underworld pin? Hero in the training, you can't just become a hero. It takes years of training. Starting out young, the little bat boy knew he was just destined for greatness. So there was one of two, and the limited edition one was lighter blue. And I do not have the lighter blue. Uh, and then we got the game, and then the prize. Looking to find that fizzy fun, the whole fun... The whole family will enjoy. Hope hop on the post-apocalyptic train to this pre-war amusement park and throw the tip kids to the raiders. While you're there, check your ticket number at and see if you're a lucky winner. Okay. okay, that's all cool. And now we have the magazine. So we got Link on the front. Or oh, it's not actually Link, is it? I can never remember. And then that on the back, and then the inside. We have someone with the charger and a source, and yes, it is going to use as that. And contents there. We have Nintendo Switch, Cap for Kids, Zelda Through the Years. It is linked then, because Zelda is someone else, if I remember rightly. Game of Corner, Featured Steam Game, Ultimate Gift Guide, and Geek Fuel Community. And we got the about, bits about the Nintendo Switch, the new console coming out for Nintendo. Not really a console man myself. I don't actually own any consoles anymore, I don't think. No, I think I might still have a PS3 stored away somewhere. Um, some stuff about geeks with a cause. Oh, cat for kids, I see. So it's um, people doing things for, well, doing things for causes, like kids in hospitals and stuff, dressing up as. People from the Avengers. Awesome stuff. Best of Zelda games over the years. So, bits to the Zelda games. Can't show all of it very well. 
and then game corner stuff like so I'm really not being able to talk much because of my voice is well, it's not hurting quite as much right now then we got geek stuff Game of Thrones replica iron drone I don't know quite how big that is but Star Trek duvet cover that's pretty awesome Rubik's Cube Blamp, Legend of Zelda Twilight Princess Link Sword. I like the idea of the Game of Thrones and the Star Trek thing there. Star Trek cover. Uh, Kirby Bath Map. Interesting. 40 si 4D Cityscape Game of Thrones Westeros puzzle. Interesting. Star Wars lightsaber barbecue tongs. <laughs> uh, Ghost in the Shell tacky yellow figure. Don't know quite what that is. Lord of the Rings dwarf plushy keyring. Archer DT, projection, alarm clock. All awesome stuff again. Archer D2 is pretty cool. Uh, even more things, okay. Stan Lee's, Stan Lee's signature clone. Dungeons and Dragons pint glass. Awesome. Player 3 baby suit. <laughs> uh, Pokemon Chandler plushie. Doctor Who 500 year diary. Oh, that's awesome. Harry Potter Grim Tea Cup Set. Awesome stuff. Player 3 has entered the game. And then we have the Geek Fuel thing. Oh, I recognise those people there. That's awesome. I'm not in it myself. But that's fine because there is a awesome channel that he, he, they do awesome things. The Moss Family Adventures. And have a look. They're there. It's the Moss Family Adventures. Awesome people. I loved their videos. So that's all the people in it. I'm not in it myself, unfortunately. But I can't always be in it. I'm in quite a few of them. But that's been that box. It was a bit of a light one. But I'm going to have to say, this is coming in very handy. Because I've been needing something like this for a while. <coughs> Voice is going... And I like the shirt. And my phone's going off. Put it onto silent and of course the alarm goes off. Whatever. Anyway, I hope you've enjoyed this video. Despite the throat being a pain. If you have, please leave the video a like. Leave your comments down below of what you think is the awesome item. Like I said, I've got to think that. And share with your friends. Subscribe if you're new to the channel. And I shall see you in another episode. Bye for now guys.